So Ford, you are really into motorsports. Yes. I love right. It. Who's your favorite race team? Uh, Junior Motorsports. Oh. <laughs> Do you have a favorite song? One of my favorites is Live Like You Were Dying by Tim McGraw. Mm -hmm. And that just reminds me to live life a little bit and, you know, take that chance just to have some fun. And you write your own songs? Well, I don't really write them down. I freestyle. I make my own rap songs. To take a minute and welcome you to the 11th Annual Driven to Give. We are here to raise money for these organizations and to help kids like Cody and Sam and Ford and so many others that you know benefit from, from what we do. Hey everybody, we've had a lot of fun down here over the years. This is our western town we like to call Whiskey River. We appreciate y'all coming out and supporting the Dale Jr. Foundation. This event tonight, Driven to Give, is our biggest money raiser of the year. Over 450 different charities over the years. Eight million dollars that we've donated. Regina and Jenny, the girls in the foundation, we need Please a round, give them a round yeah. of applause. Yeah. Those two girls right there are really the engine that makes it run. We also want to thank our event sponsors who are true partners. We couldn't do any of these events without them. And our big sponsors tonight are Blue Harbor Bank and Capital Wealth Management. Another thing that surprised me about the evening that I wasn't expecting were the, ch the wagons with the horse drawn wagons. Yeah, yeah. I hope everybody enjoyed that as well. Like myself, I'm sure a lot of you out there are parents. Maybe you've been lucky or blessed that you haven't had to have your kids in a hospital, and we're lucky because of that. What we're here tonight to do is to help Sam, Ford, and Cody, and a lot of other kids out there to have as normal a life as they could possibly have. I went to the hospital, found out that I had a cancerous tumor in my spine, so we had surgery to uh, take that out. And I had a really good experience with Children's Hospital's rehab floor. Mr. Earnhardt Jr. donated it, and it was really nice to just have an area where you could feel safe and just have some of the normal things that you could do at home. I have Ford Montel here from Camp Luck. It's a camp for kids with congenital heart disease. Like eight to 10 days after I was born, I had my first surgery. Six months later, I had my second, and then when I was three, I had my third and my final surgery. We can't go to a normal camp without medical supervision, and they have the doctors there, so it's, it's a place where I can be with kids like me. This is Cody. Cody is joining us from Children's Hope Alliance. So great organization that brings hope and healing to children like Cody who face different experiences in their life. What's been your favorite thing about Children's Hope Alliance? There's a lot of people there to help you get through things. Yep, there's a lot of caring people there. We all need those kind of people, don't we? All right, some brave young kids up here, Cody, Sam, and Ford. So who's ready for live auction fun? Are we, are we right. ready to do this? All right, for 100 guests here at the Western Town, let's start the bidding off at $1,000. Who's going to be $1,000 to be here? I got 1000 over there, now 1500 1000 over here, now fifteen. I got fifteen now 2000 2000 bid now 25 25 now 3 11000 give me 12 Boom, we got two of them right there. Woo! That's done. Sold to both of you. Right there. Woo! Great job, you guys. Thank you so much. Are y'all having fun? Got Drew Parker here, and we're going to play y'all some songs that we've wrote. We chip and change for gas in that Ranger. Just stop at the quick stop. Double dog deer, drunk double gainer off a railroad bridge by the sweet corn crop. Singing songs on the south, sweet potato pie and I shut my mouth. Gone, gone with the wind, ain't nobody looking back again. 